hardcore boxing fans out there, how are you doing? Big Porky here, the voice of hardcore boxing. And I hope you've subscribed as well or I'll be coming to pay you a visit. <laughs> Peter Fury and uh, don't forget to subscribe to Porky's Corner because I've been a helmet of the month and you need to listen to me. <laughs> yeah? So follow him, yeah? And get the fella some followers up for Christ's sake. He wears his hat on his sleeve, the good man was. So follow Porky's Corner, he says it as it is and uh, you know, I appreciate the helmet of the month, Russ. No problem. No problem. Thank you very much. You're welcome, mate. Hello all you hardcore boxing fans out there, how are you doing? It's Big Porky here and still the voice of hardcore boxing. <coughs> well, it's that time of month again isn't it? You know what time that is don't you? Weapon of the week! <laughs> Weapon of the week! <laughs> Weapon of the week. Now, let's put that over there. Well, we all the other masks. <laughs> I'm sporting the old Pow UK, UK, Ryan Rhodes' former company. Uh, did good stuff then back in the day. Right, Weapon of the Week. There's there's three contenders really for Weapon of the Week this week. Michael Buffer, mainly because he don't even he don't even run his Twitter account. <laughs> Michael Buffer, uh, Eddie Earn for his comments. I haven't decided who I'm going to pick yet, but Eddie Earn for his comments regarding opportunity and wanting to make money out of the situation with this Corona 19 virus. Eddie Earn yet again talking like he's from the stock exchange. Like his stock exchange mates, and I can understand that because I know people that have got friends who who work in stock exchange at London, and that's how they talk as well. There's there's going to be opportunities and blah de blah, but use a bit use a bit of uh, human kindness in situations like this. Have a bit. I don't know what to say, but for Eddie Hearn to come out with that, but. There's only one person that can win Weapon of the Week for this week, and there's only one person I'm going to pick, and that's Anthony, the Machine Fowler, who got who's already been beat by Fitzy, got dropped in the last round, and he and beat up Anthony, the Machine Fowler, who's best wins Brian the Lion Rose, but he's more like a kitten at the moment, isn't he? So his best wins Brian the Kitten Rose. But he's a machine and he's going around carrying off like he's some big gangster. And look, people send me in helmet votes for him all the time, but he never seems to make the top 10 or. When you're charging people 25 quid to send them a message on the birthday or when they're really in hospital, what, what's all that about? But this CB oil that he's uh, going on about, hmm. He's saying that it can cure coronavirus and all that. What? We know Anthony Fowler likes his sponsors and that, and fair enough, but that's going above and beyond, isn't it? Coming out with stuff like that. So, Anthony Fowler, you are Porky's Corner YouTube Weapon of the Week. That's chosen by me. So, Weapon of the Week. Plus, you're always going to be a weapon, aren't you, when you're managed by a weapon. And we know who your manager is, don't we? The disappearing man. So, but it's all good stuff, isn't it, Anthony? What do you think? I know you watch everything anybody says about you. So, watch this, Anthony. You are a weapon. That is weapon behaviour. Coming out with that about CBD oil. What, are you, what were you thinking? So, anyway, jog on. I don't like you.